Hello friends, um, my fellow Christians, we're on this journey together. Uh, this coming Sunday is Ascension Sunday and we lead from Ascension where the Lord returns uh, to his heavenly abode but remains present with us through the gifting of his Holy Spirit, the third person of the Trinity. So Jesus, the second person of the Trinity, returns to the Father, the first person, yet all three remain with us uh, in our journeys of life at the moment. Um, I'm hoping you can see a little bit of the uh, artwork behind me. Uh, as you can tell, it's, a, it's an Aboriginal piece of artwork uh, and it captures something of the Trinity of the Lord, of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit in uh, that, that Aboriginal style and abstract style that's present to that. In a sense, this time of uh, ascension to Pentecost is a kind of in-between time. The Lord has left us physically in his, in his human uh, reality, yet he becomes present to us in the gift of the person of the Holy Spirit. So this is a time of in-between, if you like, that we walk by faith, as St. Paul says, but not yet by sight. We walk by faith, not yet by sight. And I think I, there's something of that at the moment that we're all experiencing as these very early uh, moments of lifting of some of the restrictions is happening. We're kind of in between, aren't we? We're not, we're not back to what we had once experienced, yet there are signs of opening uh, that are important for us. I hope you're finding in all of uh, this current movement opportunities for um, uh, of renewal within yourself. I bet you you're uh, enjoying the opportunity to get out a little bit more and maybe seeing friends and family uh, now that that's possible. And thanks be to God, just the openings now around allowing uh, some of us to be able to attend Mass to, and to come into our churches if they, if they can be effectively opened uh, for prayer. So I think these are uh, little sta stages along the way in our in-between time. And, uh, and just so I wanted to draw that kind of connection for you this week between what we experience in our faith and in the ascension at this time but also what we're experiencing in our realities uh, in terms of our uh, pandemic. So I just offer those little thoughts for you this week. I continue to pray for you. I continue especially to seek uh, St. Joseph's intercession for you. And, uh, and I encourage you to find the ways in which you might be able to uh, carefully and safely just engage a little bit more with the wider world at this time. So every blessing to you all.